Good day, everyone, and welcome to today's video. Today we are going to take a close look at the Dandy Dinmont Terrier. Before we begin, please remember to like and share our video if you find it useful. Please subscribe to receive notifications when we publish new dog-related content. Dandy Dinmont Terrier Dandy Dinmont Terrier is a dog breed that originated on the border between Scotland and England. The breed may have been developed from the Sky Terrier and now extinct Scotch Terrier. The breed was popular among the gypsies and was used by farmers to kill vermin. It was able to hunt badgers and otter on the ground due to its short legs. In 1814 Sir Walter Scott wrote about the breed in his famous novel Guy Mannering. Dandy Dinmont was a character in the book, and that is how the breed acquired its name. Some of the dandy talents are vermin catcher, hunting rabbit, otter, badger, martens, weasels and skunks. Some dandies may still lead working lives. But, they are primarily kept now as family pets. As always, the pros are up first. Dandy Denmont Terrier, like many other terrier breeds, is intelligent, vigilant, and daring. These small terriers can be rather noisy, alerting you to strangers or other vital things. Dandies get along nicely with kids if they've been well socialized since they were puppies. These small canines can adapt well to city life if their mental and physical needs are met. Dandy may flourish in both apartments and larger homes due to their compact size, desirable temperament, and low exercise needs. These dogs make great family pets or travel companions, and they enjoy spending time with their human family. Now it's time for some cons. Dandy Terriers aren't usually a good fit for households with other pets or small children. Their natural instincts may take over, driving them to chase and nip. But, they are also vulnerable to injuries if young children do not understand how to play and interact with them. Appearance Because of its tiny legs, the dandy keeps its entire body close to the ground. They have dark white eyes, low hanging ears, and a tapering tail that is usually about the same length as the dog. The coat on these dogs is thick and dense, with a hard but not wiry texture. Standard colors for the breed include mustard and pepper. They come in two color coats, mustard and pepper. Mustard ranges in color from fawn to auburn. Pepper range from silver gray to purplish blue. To keep their coat in good shape, they should hand strip it a few times a year and brush it every day. You Dandy Dinmont Terrier just need to be bathed when they get dirty. Dandies are around 8 to 11 inches tall as adults. But, they are stocky for their height, weighing between 18 and 24 pounds. Dandy Terrier can live to be up to 12 to 15 years of age. Grooming. Although dandies are working dogs, their coat requires regular maintenance. To retain their unique form and appearance, you should clip their coats with scissors every 4 to 6 weeks. They should also be brushed with a gentle brush several times per week to remove any mats or knots. Despite the fact that this breed's coat requires more maintenance than other terriers, its low shedding nature is good for allergy sufferers. They are also prone to digging, so it's helpful to train against this habit or create a designated digging area in your yard. Trim their nails once a month and clean their teeth regularly to secure a fresh breath, and to prevent bacteria development and gum disease. During all of this, keep an eye on their ears for signs of infection, such as redness or a bad odor. Shedding Dandy is a light shedder and brush your dog about two to three times each week to remove dead hair. The thick fur that crowns your dandy head should be regularly trimmed to keep it out of his eyes. Cost The average cost of a dandy Dinmont Terrier will fall between $1,500 and $3,000. The cost to adopt a dandy is around $300 in order to cover the expenses of caring for the dog before adoption. The average price of a dandy puppy in India is around 20,000 to 30,000 rupees. It varies due to the breeder's reputation, location, and the dog's pedigree, age, and gender. Exercise and trainability. To keep your dandy well exercised, aim for a few walks or two 20 to 30 minutes periods of playtime each day. Because dandies are little dogs, they will not require as much activity as larger, longer-legged breeds. Activities such as climbing stairs or jumping can create back problems due to their short legs. 
Dandies are intelligent dogs who enjoy learning and stimulating their minds. However, they were not bred to work closely with people in the past, it may take some time to build up motivation and enthusiasm for training. Positive reinforcement approaches are an excellent way to achieve this, whilst also developing a deep bond. It's also worth noting that these dogs should never be left unattended in an unfenced area. They have a strong prey drive, which means that if given the chance, they will chase after birds, squirrels, and other creatures. This breed is prone to obesity, it's critical to maintain a regular exercise routine while also keeping an eye on food intake. Intelligence Dandy Dinmont Terrier belongs to the Fair Working Slash Obedience Intelligence Dogs category. According to the Intelligence of Dogs by Stanley Corrin, Dandy Dinmont Terrier is ranked 62. Understanding of new commands 40 to 80 repetitions and obeys first command 30% of the time or better. Barking Dandy has a deceptively loud, deep bark for their size, but doesn't use it to excess. Like most dogs, they bark to alert. Friendliness The Dandy is a fantastic breed for families because of its loving personality and a fondness of children. If raised together, they may get along fine with cats, but because of the breed's hunting instincts. These pups should not be left alone with non-canine pets. Adaptability they behave well in apartments, but need to be kept on a leash or in a contained area to avoid chasing after another animal. They won't enjoy being left alone for long periods, it's not recommended for more than 4 hours. Guard slash watchdog. This breed can be reserved with strangers and makes a superb watchdog, but it must be socialized to avoid shyness. The dogs are confident and independent, but they may be stubborn at times. Dandy is an alert watchdog and, while not high-strung or noisy, gives a surprisingly loud bark. When tested or provoked, this little dog will never back down. He makes a great guard dog and will alert you to strangers or even the neighborhood mailman. Have you had any experience with Dandy Dinmont Terrier? In the comment section below, we'd love to hear your story. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the future video.